it'd be busy, busy, busy all through the day. You get up and you just go right to work, you know, right to work. There was always something to do. There was never any idle time. The only idle time we had was after we eat and before we go to bed. One of the older people would just be just relaxing, laying down there and saying, you know, it'd be really nice to hear a story. And then just organically, someone would just start telling the story. Storytelling for the Nupiak people is very important because it not only created that sense of community, but is a way to pass on wisdom to the next generation. It was like TV, you know? <laughs> it was just like, it was as good as anything, you, any movie you've ever seen. And the storyteller told it so clearly that it was just as powerful as any of the greatest movie blockbusters you've ever seen. There was a reason behind the stories that we were told because they held traditional knowledge. They held things that we might need to know in life, whether it was about how to find food or how to survive, or it was about well-being and the importance of connecting with people and being a good member of the community. We all do stories. We all live in stories. We all tell stories to our friends and, and they need to be told. They need to be heard.